Graham, um, there's nowhere I like this in terms of working space in Dublin. Um, it's a boat. You're opening it up to startups to use as co-working space. Uh, how did this come about? Uh, well, well t- two ways, I guess. One, I had a small startup myself and I was kind of looking around for space in Dublin. Um, I wanted to sort of be here, not necessarily underwater, but like silicon docks. I was like, well, what about a boat? It's the only bit of the area here, not office space already. How many co-workers or how many startups or how many companies or entities do you expect to host in here? Um, so in this boat here, we think 12. Um, so there's going to be eight in the main area. Um, so that's kind of the open plan. Everybody knows everybody. There's going to be four, maybe five. Um, we're going to have an office up front. And then there's going to be a couple of people dropping in and out. There'll be the hot desking space. So you might have maybe a half dozen there, um, but they won't be there all the time. So this is our um, this is our kind of common co-working area here. We have eight desks, two, 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 and two over there. Um, our social entrepreneurs sit there and then these are our standard monthly uh, permanent desks. Over here around the corner we have um, our hot desk spot uh, so people can kind of come in a couple of hours you know they might have a meeting or something like that in town so they can sit there look out the window and um, we get this heron which comes by each day and just sort of sits there fishing so that looks kind of cool. Um, down the end our coffee dock area and um, coffee tea there's a fridge in that press with water and coke and then our beer tap for um, beer o'clock Fridays sits over on the right side there. So this is the hallway which leads down to the uh, to the conference room, so I'll show you then. This is our scheduler here, so you can kind of see what's going on in the conference room, and maybe you might want to book in, or you can send a message to whoever's in there and say, get out, I'm booked in. Our 37-inch screen here, which uh, is Chromecast enabled, so you can just come in, turn on your laptop, off you go. Whiteboard there, and then I think a pretty kicking view of the old bone mills and uh, Google's, Google's head office is just there. And what kind of facilities are on the boat? Obviously you expect your heat, your light, your shelter and so on, your internet, your broadband, your table. That's all a given, it's there. In addition you get your coffee, your coke, your 7-up, uh, your tea um, and then at the last Friday of every month we'll also have a barbecue, so there's a barbecue on board. And have you had any, uh, any, any startups who are coming on board for this? People were told about this on Tuesday for the first time. Before that we had told no one, right? A few friends knew a few people that were helping out and people were getting in touch with us left, right and centre. Like, how are you guys hearing about this? I think you have an eye on the future. Would you consider expanding this? Uh, for sure. So two ways expanding. Um, hopefully here in the area things go well. Um, Waterways Ireland being super supportive at the moment. So we'll kind of we'll go ahead and see if it makes sense to you know, get a second boat or whatnot. Um, in Galway, we're looking at getting um, so the shipping container complex going. So exactly like the barge, but with shipping containers instead. Um, Belfast, we're kind of saying, does it make sense to have a bit of a look for something up there? And ultimately, it'll become like gym membership. You join one, you can use the others.